Now, last week, our resident DIYer made a few stops at local schools to get students to do our work for us. That's how we do it here. No, to make ornaments for our Christmas trees. Dina's standing by, ready to decorate one of our trees with some of those ornaments. Hey, Dina. <laughs> yes, well, you know I love my Dina IY segments, but we started this last year. I had this fun idea to go and solicit our local kiddos at our schools and get them involved in the holiday process of decorating the Good Day Studio. So we have this lonely little tree. It's we've, we've kept it lonely for a reason because yeah. we knew this was coming. <laughs> so uh, I want to take you out to Woodland where we went to Gibson Elementary last week and collected our first batch of ornaments. So let's go ahead and show you some of that video this morning. The kiddos are so cute. Oh my gosh, look at them. So they were so darling. It's a first and third grade class combined. Amy Daniels and Rachel White were the two teachers. Again, this is Gibson Elementary in Woodland. And they created little light bulbs for us. And nice. um, because, you know, they said the holiday season is about the gift of light and I thought it was so cute. So each of their ornaments actually have a little tag on them and it reads the light of friendship. May there always be a light in your heart for the true meaning of Christmas, peace, love and friendship. And so each of them made, I just thought this was such a good idea. What a fun craft for the kids. So basically they poured Elmer's glue down through the little light bulb, it's plastic, and then they just dumped a bunch of glitter and they oh, got to get real creative with fun. the glitter. It was a little messy. Teachers, we appreciated all you did. <laughs> they're they're, <laughs> we they're still before. vacuuming yeah. glitter out of that class. They yeah. are. We're gonna, they're going to find it in places forever. And um, we left before the cleanup process started. Oh, so. Smart. I had to get back. Great. Right. Another live segment. So, you know, so we're going to start by hanging these up on the tree this morning. So, to the students at Gibson in Woodland, thank you so much. They're thank so you, beautiful. Gibson. And Ooh, what great. a wonderful way to start our holiday tree tradition this season, yeah. right? With a couple of literal light bulbs lighting the background of our good day set. And we have a little mixture of first and, and third graders here. They were a part of a buddy system. Okay. So the first and third graders meet up um, a couple of times throughout the month and they help read with one another. They do crafts together. And so the little first graders, you know, feel like they have a buddy. That's, yeah. Feel like they have an older buddy, which I thought was adorable. one of the big kids, right? Yeah. One of the big kids. But look at this. I mean, I love that they got really creative. They did. And so at first when we were, we were there, the glue wasn't dried yet. And they were very, you know, they wanted to make sure we know it's going to dry with the glitter. I, went, I was like, I trust you. Don't worry. We know. We know. <laughs> so guys, I'll just keep decorating with this. Okay. And then throughout the show, we're going to take you to some of the other schools that helped us to decorate. This we have we have a amazing. Fruit Loop string we got to hang up. We oh, have uh, some little reindeer and a couple of other. Oh, and snowflakes, my favorite. So, I love that you came up with this idea for to showcase the you know artistic value of our kids. Yes, it kind of came out of necessity because we were struggling on decorating. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, no, it was really it's really no, fun to not. go back to the she's schools. And also the, <laughs> the teachers made these really fun lessons for the students. Oh, very. Cool. And so I think for them, you know, it was fun and they yeah. got to be in the holiday spirit a little bit early with us last week. So we're just love keep, it. Oh, that one doesn't it's not tied, but I'm going to keep tying them and I'm going to keep hanging them. OK, oh, look how cute. And if, and if we have any kind of one unifying um, ethos here, it's <laughs> that when things get hard, have kids do it. Yes. Hire out. <laughs> yes. And kids also always say the best things on live television. So yes, I encourage you to go back part. and watch those segments on our that website, part. gooddaysacramento.com. And then for next year, we want to do it again. So if yeah. you have a school that you think would be interested, if you're a teacher watching and you have some students who are specifically crafty uh, and you're next year too, mm -hmm. let me know because we would love to come back out and continue the tradition for the next few years. Love it. So, yeah. Thanks, Dina. So pretty. Thank you, Dina. Thanks, Bye. Gibson.